Hey guys, it's Nikki from Stimworms Nursery. I haven't shown you in my um, reborn room for a while, so I thought I'd give you a quick update on um, the dolls that I've got for sale and um, my reborns and a few other little bits and pieces. So first we've got Natalie. And Natalie's my little one. And she's the Paisley doll kit. And she's got dark brown eyes. And of course she's not for sale because she's my baby. And then Ebony, and this little one's still looking for a home. She's a gorgeous little sleeping baby. And she's got curly blonde hair, which has been hand rooted. And she's got a little magnetic little ribbon in her hair. And she's going home in the little love heart um, outfit. So, little three piece, it's got a little shirt on underneath and little bloomers and little socks and I've got um, a Jacob kit um, up here he's a little preemie um, still doing his hair at the moment so he's not ready um, just quite yet but he's so tiny and I found these little um, preemie booties for him which actually fit him just perfectly and it was quite funny because he hasn't got a head on and then I've got my porcelain dolls um, that I collected. So I've got my little African baby and my little Caucasian girl and these were my first two um, porcelain and then I've got um, baby Rebecca and she's looking for a home as well and she's got um, very fine blonde uh, mohair and she's a little grizzly baby and she's a little preemie as well so she's a 17 inch doll kit, it's her little feet, and she's the McCaslin, one of the McCaslin doll kits, I think and she came out with four, so she's one of them, and then Jackson, who has already found a mummy, and little Vanessa, who has found a mummy as well, and these two little ones are going to the same home, so that's why they're sitting together and then over in the cot so I've got them sort of displayed on my little um, display and I've got in the cot I've got little Bonnie the Daisy by Bonnie Brown um, doll kit that I've just finished so I've still got to do her nails um, and do her hair but I couldn't resist putting her um, little head on just to sort of see um, what she looked like and she's adorable so she's going to be a little hard one to part with but there's her little hands and I've still got to bunch her little lips as well but she's precious and I put her in a little yellow um, grow suit which just makes her look adorable and then Savannah and she's still looking for a home as well so she's my little um, ethnic um, ember She's a beautiful kit. I love doing um, this doll kit because she's she just fits uh, really like um, if you the vlog that I did um, earlier or that's coming up I should say um, about the bodies. She's actually got um, the body that's got the full legs, so um, she's got no hip joints, which is really good. So she's easy to sort of um, pose and put into little, little diapers. But she's adorable, so she's still looking for a mummy. So if anybody wants to adopt Savannah, I'll put a link in the um, descriptions bar below so you guys can um, find her and have a look at all her little pictures and, and everything like that. So she can hold her dummy. So they're the little ones that are out on um, the display. And then in my little room, I've got... Um, in the hospital crib at the moment, I've got um, my baby Jonathan. So he's sleeping. And I found this mobile, so I've just hung that up on um, the railing. So that's over his little crib. There's a couple of little toys and stuff. And then all my other teddies are underneath there. And then all the outfits. I've got a couple of blankets um, that are going home. Um, with a couple of custom order dolls 
So I thought these ones were really, really pretty. So they'll go with both boys and girls. So there's a couple, couple there, different colours. There's a yellow one, so I might put that with um, a little daisy if she goes home. If I decide to sell her, I can't, de can't decide yet. And then I've got a couple of little outfits. A couple of um, toddler outfits and outfits that you guys would have seen in like the Kmart haul and things like that. So I've got all them all ready for the dolls that are coming out and the custom order dolls and and things like that. And just some more little outfits and some, I've got these if you guys are actually looking for some smocked um, outfits. I do have these available uh, for sale online so um, I'll put a link to these in the descriptions bar as well so and these are just absolutely adorable and they're the Rosalina brand and they're actually baby clothing so um, they're made to sort of be more durable than actually dolls clothes but um, they're adorable <coughs> I've got a couple of different ones I've got just like the plain night white night dress which has got the little um, beading around the top and then these ones are just adorable so I've got a pink and a blue um, in the same sort of design just got little smocked around the top and it's a little dress hasn't got any bloomers but um, adorable nonetheless and I've got it in the blue as well and I like the blue I think a blue just looks adorable so it's got little rose buds as well little button um, ties at the back and I've got just a little bubble suit I think they call these but I'll put a link to all of these um, if you guys are sort of interested in buying them um, and I've got a little this one's for like a little 16 to sort of inch kit and it's got the same sort of um, rosebuds on it and I've got bibs as well um, in the smocked, just the smocked top, which look adorable. So they actually go with, or well they can go with a couple of um, the other outfits. And then I've got just um, some different colour shirts um, for my custom order dolls. And some rompers and um, other little bits and pieces um, there. And I've got baby Gemma, or toddler Gemma. So she's actually found a mummy and um, she's actually on layaway so when I've actually had a number of requests for you guys uh, from you guys um, asking me to do a box packing of her so when she's ready to go home I will um, be doing a box packing of her and then on the shelf or my little drawer set um, I've got here I've just got the toys um, I've got a couple of hats and mittens and little shoes so little toddler shoes um, which fit her really well. So I've got a couple of those for um, the toddlers that I've got coming up. Um, just the hair stuff that I've got to keep them nice. Just some um, display props of um, like baby oil. Um, the bottles that I made um, in a vlog. Um, some turned out, some didn't, but that was supposed to be sort of orange juice, but it looks more like carrot. And of course my apple juice, which doesn't look like apple juice but it was fun to make there's my banana milk it was fun to make and then my little just toys that I've picked up here and there I couldn't resist that because his, his little face got me That's just a little rattle and I like the bright colors because in photos um, the bright toys look really good so, another little one uh, rubber ducky and some toys or some blocks and um, then I've got the Winnie the Pooh sort of a toddler toy at the back there um, just some little um, six inch dolls that um, I got as freebies so I've just sort of put them together and then up the top I've got uh, more teddies um, some flowers that I like to put sort of um, around my dolls as I'm taking their photos uh, my magic nursery doll so my first doll you would have seen her in the vlogs and then just a couple of other little toys and blocks and sort of stuff that I've picked up again 
nice bright colours so it makes the photos look really good and a toddler truck in the back there and another one of my porcelain dolls and then all my blankets and props and that's about it guys so that's my little um, room I'll come out here so you guys can see and then I've got you know my other sort of displays and outfits ready for their mums and got my lights on ready so you guys were asking too what lights I use so I've got two of these umbrellas with the big um, bulbs on them and then I've got two um, soft boxes so I actually use those to paint with so I'll just turn they've got two bulbs in them and I'll just turn one side on to um, you know give me the light I need to paint and then over the back there I've got a um, tent cube so I'll, um, when I'm taking photos of sort of the premies um, I'll tend to put them in there and then a couple of outfits that I've got ready the dolls that I'm about to finish and my little crib thing or chair um, that I picked up my two spotlights of course so they're really handy that I can put anywhere to sort of give me the light that I need and that's my little room with all the clothes and stuff in it and there you go guys that's my room and sort of the dolls um, that I've got for sale so I'll, I'll put a link in the descriptions bar um, for the ones that um, are for sale um, but yeah I hope you enjoyed my new tour um, let me know what you guys think um, and I'll talk to you guys soon bye